St. Barbara Walters does a news special about the minimum vision requirement to own a driver's license in most U.S. states. What would be an appropriate name for the show? 2010, 2020, 2040, or 2100? Up to you, Player 3. In order to obtain a driver's license in most U.S. states, you must have at least 2040 vision. It's just like how you have to be able to speak very clearly if you want to be a news anchor. Oh, wait a minute. Player 3, what looks good to you? Check out my new shouting calculator. 3 times 5 equals... This category is known as, I have a doomsday device. Mm, yes, I'll hold. Think you can handle $6,001 bills? Let's see how you handle this one. Suppose you're an evil genius with a doomsday device and you're looking for a newspaper to publish your demands. If you want to reach the most people, which daily paper do you call? The New York Times, the Los Angeles Times, the Wall Street Journal, or USA Today? Player 2, it's yours. Let this be a lesson to you. Player 1, player 3, who's gonna grab it? Player 1. Hi, USA Today. Yes, I'm a mad genius with a doomsday device. Hold, please. Okay. Player 3. Player 3, what, you think a lot of people read the New York Times? They don't even have cartoons. <laughs> Pathetic. <laughs> the Wall Street Journal tops them all with a circulation of about 1.8 million daily. So it would be preferable if you could send your demands as a series of abbreviations and encoded numbers that no one can understand. <laughs> your pick, Player 2. All right, Player 2, you're up for some major cash here. Player 1, Player 3, go get a drink or something, because Player 2 is going to do a dis or dat. I have a BS in peace. Okay, I'm going to read off seven areas of study, and for each one, I want you to tell me if it's a Nobel Prize category or an otherwise useless college major. If it's an area of study that can win you a Nobel Prize, press 1... If it's just another useless college major, press 2 and press 4 to skip. Each correct answer will net you 1,000 bucks. And 1,000 taken away for each incorrect answer in any that you don't get to. Okay, can I have 30 seconds on the clock, please? Let's dance. Drama, Nobel Prize or useless college major. Literature. French literature. Physics. Econ. Chemistry. This is it. Gender. That's all she wrote. Only one wrong. Pretty damn good, cowboy. Let's toss that into your total. Hey, that's something. Let's keep going. Player one. Now serving Dress to Kill. And it's worth $2,000 if you get this one right. Okay, change out of your sweatpants and see if you can complete the following analogy. Stiletto is to high heels as choker is to earrings, muffler is to hat, sheath is to dress, or thong is to butt crack. You're screwed, player one. Give me an answer. Stilettos are a type of high-heeled shoe, and a sheath is a close-fitting style of dress. <laughs> and both are very flattering to a woman's arsenal. <laughs> Guess what, Player 3? You're the one who's screwed! <laughs> Player 1, your choice. What are we doing? Shake hands with. Didn't win. Suck it up. You get 4,000 clams for this one. Let's rock. Suppose the makers of OB tampons receive an OB award. For what are they most likely being honored? Absorption in an abstract artist's studio? Absorption in an off-Broadway production? Absorption in an American chef's kitchen? Or absorption in Ron Howard? Up to you, player three. 
Obie Awards are given each year for excellence in off-Broadway productions. <laughs> and when an off-Broadway show succeeds, it's a real on-the-rag-to-riches story. Your call, Player 3. <clears throat> hey! 19! Well, what do we have here? The witch is back. One right answer and $6,000 head your way. Flex those fingers, because here it comes. Suppose Samantha from Bewitched is facing a triple witching hour. What can you assume she has recently done? Been caught in a thunderstorm, gotten a job on Wall Street, broken the witch's code, or landed a role in King Lear? Player three, do it. On Wall Street, a triple witching hour happens on the third Friday of March, June, September, and December when expiring options lead to heavy trading. <laughs> Mrs. Stevens, our company is ruined. We've lost everything. Okay, we're rich again. Thanks, Mrs. Stevens. Player three, time to... The selection is... Freebird! Yeah. Get it right, I'm handing over 2K. Just step up and take a swing at this one. Which of the following describes in order the musical happenings in the classic rock anthem Freebird? Starts fast, gets slower, gets fast again. Starts slow, gets faster, has endless solos. Starts slow, gets slower, and suddenly, or starts fast, gets faster, explodes. <laughs> Layer 2, grab it! In Leonard Skinner's ditty they call Freebird, the song starts off nice and slow and ballady, speeds up after a few minutes, and then has about a zillion guitar solos. <laughs> and what did they do when it came to making a live version of the tune? They made it longer. Uh, thanks, guys. Your turn, player 2. Welcome to the Jack Attack. Keep your eyes on the screen, and when you see two words that match, hit your buzzer. If you're right, I give you 2,000 bucks. If you're wrong, you're going down 2,000. But don't forget, remember the clue. Not any old word's gonna do it. It's gotta be a match that fits this clue. Oh no! Well, that's never a good sign. Uh, well, just try to be positive. Good luck. they are, and the next they're telling you